new Dustin Hoffman accuser reveals his horrific, demoralizing sexual assaults on Broadway. Just like so many other stars over the last few months, Dustin Hoffman has been accused of sexual misconduct by multiple women, and another one just came forward today with a horrible story about Hoffman's alleged actions on Broadway. Catherine Rossetter co-starred with Hoffman in Death of a Salesman Live on Broadway and in the TV movie decades ago, and earlier today on THR, she came forward with a terrible account of Hoffman's alleged behavior on set years ago. Related, Dead star Jessica Bartholomew claims producer drugged and sexually assaulted her in a guest column, Rossetter recounted how even from the very beginning after being given the role, she knew something was amiss when Hoffman let on during the very first week of rehearsals. Below, during the first week of rehearsals, he took me to lunch. Walking back to rehearsal, he said he had to stop by his hotel room to pick up something he forgot. I asked, why a hotel room? He only lived a little over a mile away. He said so he could take naps at lunch, if needed, and when they were working on scenes he wasn't and he could go there and relax and study his lines. When we stepped into the room, he jumped on the bed and said, Give me a back rub. He pulled off his shirt. I didn't know what to do. I said we had to be back at rehearsal in 15 minutes. He said, Just a quickie. I was a nervous wreck but sat on the bed and gave a very lame rub. The maid walked in and I almost fainted. He laughed. As we prepared to leave, he looked at me and said, Now we have our hotel room. That was the beginning of what was to become a horrific, demoralizing and abusive experience at the hands, literally, of one of my acting idols. Wow. Not a promising start. And it turned out that this was only the beginning of what would end up being a horrifying experience for the poor young actress. Related, Kevin Spacey lured Teen into his bed by sobbing Rossetter recalled further how one night in Chicago, in the middle of a live performance while she was waiting for her cue to go on stage, Hoffman took it to another level. Below, one night in Chicago, I felt his hand up under my slip on the inside of my thighs. I was completely surprised and tried to bat him away while watching the stage for my cues. After the show he was busy with the producer and director so I had no access to him to address it. It then happened almost every show. Six to eight shows a week. I couldn't speak to him in the moment because I was on a live mic. He kept it up and got more and more aggressive. One night he actually started to stick his fingers inside me. Night after night I went home and cried. I withdrew and got depressed and did not have any good interpersonal relationships with the cast. How could the same man who fought to get me the job, who complimented my work, who essentially launched my career, who gave me the benefit of his wisdom as an actor, how could he also be this sexual power abuser? Was I doing something? Was it my fault? WTF? Seriously, what? The? Fuck. In what realm is any of this okay? Question mark you can read the whole disturbing, disgusting piece and all the accusations here. Image via Rob Bridge slash when. Tags, controversy, Dustin Hoffman, Icky Icky Poo, Catherine Rossetter, legal matters, news, sad sad, sex, sexual assault, sexual misconduct, viral, news yet another Kardashian has been accused of ripping off someone else's designs. But Kim Kardashian West says she has a reason for it. In case you didn't see, the reality TV star unveiled two new outfits for her kids' clothing line Kids Supply this week, which were blatantly recreated from looks in St. West and Northwest's own closet. Related, Kim called out for cultural appropriation in New Song. A silver vetements dress worn by Kim's daughter and a black Com de Garcons bomber worn by her son were chosen to be mass produced and up for sale on Kimmy's site, leading Instagram account at diet underscore Prada and countless commenters to call out the star. See, below, image via Brian to slash when.